Hey everybody, it's Ro. Welcome back to my channel today. I'm hanging out with my friend Justine. Hi. You guys know Justine. We've done a million videos together. We definitely have. Yeah, but if you have not seen Justine, you haven't seen this dynamic duo, head over to her channel. I'm going to be putting a link down below. Justine, thank you for coming over for so today's excited. video where you're doing something we've never done before. I got this idea. I saw a lot of people doing this online. Today, we are going to be trying eight things. All of them are edible. One is gonna be expensive and one is gonna be cheap. My team, my sister, Stephanie, they put this together, so I don't know. And I feel like I'm a foodie. If I get these wrong, I'm gonna be really embarrassed, but whatever. But it's hard to tell, because like, how are you supposed to know? Sometimes you can't taste price, and sometimes you can. Well, I guess we're gonna find out today. So the goal is to get the most points today. It's out of eight. Oh, it's a competition. Oh. It's a competition, but when I say it's a competition, it's pretty loose. Yeah. You but know? We, we work together. We're playing it fast and loose here. <laughs> More loose. <laughs> if you guys like this idea and you like this video, give it a thumbs up, click subscribe, and ring the bell to receive notifications every time I post a new video, because we are trying some new fun foodie things. Oh, we can use all the senses. Mike's telling us this, and they put them in identical things, is okay, what they okay. said. So we don't have to be blindfolded. First thing, Gummy bears. I'm scared because I, I don't really know if I can tell the difference. Mm, wait, are we? Yeah, you could say this. Wait, or do we talk about it after we have made our decision? Because <gasps> now, like, I don't want to be like giving you my idea of why I think something might be. I'm noticing a color difference. Okay, well, you're already going for it. So that was what I was also noticing. Mm -hmm. Some this... more vibrant colors over here. And then these are kind of like lighter pastel colors. So I kind of feel like this might be a more premium bear. Yeah, it smells like money. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, Do you smell yes. the money? The lighter bears have more fragrance and they smell more natural. I'm gonna taste this one first. Oh, that's definitely cheating. That's plastic. I know these gummy bears. I eat these all the time. I could tell you the brand name of the cheap one. Oh, so this is the cheap one. Oh, that's the, <laughs> one that the cheap one. I've eaten thousands of these. Here. These are the expensive ones. These are the cheap. The cheap. Final answer. How'd we do? Yeah, that's right. Those ones are sugar peanut. Sugar peanut. Yes. Haribo. Oh. Haribo. Yay. Yay. So what, do we know the prices of them? Sugar Fina is three dollars an ounce, and the Haribo is twenty nine cents an ounce. Oh, that's a big difference. I don't want to say toot our own horns, but toot toot toot. toot. We fancy, Jesse. We fancy. We fancy. We fancy. So the second one looks like mac and cheese. Yes, girl. Okay. We each have two spoons. We can take a bite of each. Okay. I'm gonna smell this one first. Okay. Mmm. These pasta noodles are skinnier, a little thinner. These are thicker. This is real thick nude. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thick nude over here. Also, a little bit more orangey cheddar over here. I this is uh, very pale. So let's taste. Okay. Not very creamy. It's almost like a naked noodle. Naked nude. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. So, breaks. <laughs> I don't really, this one has a weird like powdery type We're taste to gritty. it. Ready? I think this is supposed to be healthy pasta. I think so too. I didn't really like either one of them, to be honest with no. you. No. I usually love mac and cheese, so I don't know what's going on here. This one is more expensive. I think it's supposed to be healthy. I don't think it's this is even craft. I think there's something below craft. Nuh uh. Yeah. yeah. Nuh uh. Yeah, because craft is like kind of good. I love craft. Oh, you're right, that one's called Plant Camp. That's <gasps> 99. Cents an ounce, and the other one's Trader Joe's Wisconsin Cheddar. It's 13 cents an ounce. Trader Joe's, you've let us down. TJ's, I'm sad. I love TJ's, and this mac and cheese is no. no. Yeah. Next one, next one. What goes with dinner? Champagne. Champagne <laughs> dreams. <laughs> okay, so we've got two glasses in front of us. I haven't drank in like over three years, so I'm gonna do the smell test. I have never taken a wine tasting class. I don't know much about this. So I'm just going to um, try to use maybe memory. Don't get me wrong, like I've definitely had my share of times, <laughs> okay? I'm having some flashbacks to some <laughs> smells of some fancy occasions when I may have oh. some drinks and then some not so fancy. I think I might know, but I'm not sure. So I'm just looking at them and this one is a little bit lighter in color and this one is a little bit more yellow. I'm gonna smell them, okay. Fruity? 
light. I'm gonna smell this other one. I'm excited to a see. A little bit more to that one. This one smells a lot sweeter, so I feel like this is gonna have a much like sweeter taste to it. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, tastes a little bit more like sour. All right, I'm gonna taste this one now. More soapy. Soapy? <laughs> the soapy one has way more bubbles going on. Do you think that's soap? Um, <laughs> <laughs> this is what drives me crazy about wines and spirits, is sometimes the more expensive ones, it's all your preference. You know, some fancy things are weird. Yeah. Fancy. Cheap. Are we wrong? Yeah, you're wrong. Oh, oh no! The soap one? One is a $600 bottle, and the other one's a $5 bottle of Andre's. Oh my gosh, I am embarrassed. This is exactly why I said I, I think need to I might need to take a sip of this $600. Yeah, this is a $600 <laughs> bottle of champagne. And this is a $5. Fine. Justine, you hold the bougie one. Look how nice this bottle is. Wow. Yeah, freaking and wow. Here's the soapy one. This has like a metallic engraving. Oh, wow. Thank you, Greg. Greg gave Fancy. us this. This is really sweet. We were saving it for a special occasion, and this is the occasion. <laughs> and I can't believe we didn't even know it. All right, team, you guys got to have a glass of this because, you know, don't let this go to yeah. waste. This is fancy over Pop here. that back. Halfway there, the fourth one is peanut butter. I love peanut butter. It's like my favorite Same. snack. Okay, one's is a little that? thicker, creamier. This is a little Jokes. bit, yeah, it looks like peanuts. Okay. Oh, there's actual peanuts in here? Yeah. I like that. Mm? Oh my God, what is that? What is this? Some kind of like brittle up in here? Like what is, what did I just eat? Kicks. Like that cereal, do you remember the cereal kicks? Yes, and I haven't even tasted the other one and I think this is expensive. Oh! That was fancy, I never had something like that in my life. I will take out a loan. <gasps> Let me taste this one. This is really creamy, it's thicker, kind of salty. It's I mean, so good. The sodium's a little too high, so I, I, I think this is the expensive. It tastes like fanciness. It tastes like all my palate is like, yeah. What is that crunch? You're right, this is the butter. They don't really say what the <gasps> crunch is. Ooh, okay. I think it does. It says honeybee. Did we just eat a bee? Did we eat a bee? Oh, Did they, is there, was it a bee? No. Yeah, they, they don't say what the no, crunch no, is. No, 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 it's not a bee. Hi. It's honeycomb or Did something. Did we eat a bee? No. Is it a, is it a, it's gluten. The cheap one. Uh huh. As Kroger, it's nine cents an ounce. Nine oh. cents. Okay. And then this one by American Dream Nut Butter Ooh. is seventy-one cents an ounce. So like eight times as much. Eight times as expensive, and you can taste it. Honestly, Kroger though, like, call me. Like, I'll I'll accept you. Boom! We just got another fancy point on the board. Bring out the next one. I'm feeling like my luck is back. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. So here's the next item. In front of us, we have two glasses of water. Huh. You wanna smell them? Smell anything? No. I smell not, whoa. The left smells crisper. I can't explain it. They don't look any different to me. Which one are you gonna sip first? I'm gonna go for okay. right. Okay. I drink a lot of bottled water, so. I think the left <clears throat> is fancy. Here, let, me, let me just say why. This tastes like ice. I can't explain that. Okay, honestly, I have no idea. This one tastes different, but I don't know which is which. We think this one is more expensive. All right, you're correct. <gasps> That is the iceberg water. Iceberg? Iceberg? It's called Berg. So Crystal Geyser is like 12 cents a bottle. 12 cents oh. a bottle. Oh, big pack. Okay. And then the Berg water Berg is, is $15 per bottle. $15, $15 per bottle. That's why you guys, this tastes like nature. It tastes just like smart water. It's, oh, it comes in this freaking wow. crazy thing. It's from Canada. This is from a glacier. The unmistakable taste of clean, Pure iceberg water. We're drinking an ice. I li didn't. I literally say it tastes like ice. It, yeah, you did. I, li I literally said it tastes like ice. I'm gonna enjoy this fancy day of water and champs and bubblies and. I'm gonna sip this with my pinky up because this is we're drinking an, an iceberg. iceberg. In front of us, we have got some chocolate truffles. This seems like it has a little more decoration on it. The chocolate here is 
cracked. Should we cut the into them? Yeah, or maybe let's, let's get make a, like, a little... taste though, okay. because we don't know. So let's cut them in half. And I love. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I love white chocolate, um, so I'm very excited to try that. Okay, so it looks like we've got a white chocolate, a milk chocolate, and a dark chocolate. You take a half. I'm gonna take a half. Let's do the shiny white chocolate. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. It's delicious. All right, now I'm gonna taste the other one. Okay. Depth. A more refined taste. The other white chocolate tastes like, basically if you walk into CVS and you buy mm -hmm. like a white chocolate bunny for Easter. Okay. That's what it tastes like to me. Okay, dark chocolate over here. Dark chocolate, okay. This tastes like the CVS chocolate aisle. This doesn't taste very fancy. But like, it's good. You can't go wrong with chocolate. The sugars taste cheaper. So I'm thinking these are the expensive ones. I'm gonna taste the dark chocolate over here. And like, do I care? No. <laughs> Oh, wow. Whoa. I don't the, really like dark chocolate. The bitterness is higher. It's a complex. It's bitter. Wow. And it was like that dark chocolate was not wow. actually dark chocolate. No, it almost tastes like another milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. I'll taste this little milk chocolate just for fun, but this is oh, yummy. Oh. Mm. Oh my god. Oh, wow. This there's is spice. really good. There's like, yeah. There's spice in it. What is that? It's like a little allspice, like something. It's delicious. These ones were more expensive. I left these. I okay. and finished them. <laughs> <laughs> Just <eat>. No shame. <laughs> CBS, I love you. Woo woo. These are more expensive. Yeah, you got it right. The cheap yes. ones were Lint, Lindor, Gourmet and Truffles. They were okay. 80 cents an ounce. 80 cents an ounce. And then the other ones were from an exotic truffle collection. They were $8.16 per ounce. Oh! Are you gonna eat those? No. <laughs> <laughs> Number seven is potato chips. <laughs> and you know, I'm not gonna lie, I've eaten a lot of chips in my day. Same. So I feel like we're gonna be able to do this pretty easily, just by looking. Wow, do you think by looks, you could guess right now which one is more expensive because you have had so many potato chips. I think that's This one. This looks like your freaking yellow Lay's chip bag that I have just <laughs> destroyed <laughs> all through college, my gaming career. Like this is a yeah. Lay's potato chip. This does look like a Lay. You got all these little air bubbles in you. And you don't disappoint, but I don't know what this is. It looks fancy. It looks more refined. It's a thicker texture. Chip. It's a darker color, yellow. Maybe it's baked. There's little burnt edges here. Maybe it's not. That does taste baked. What's the flavor here? What the flavor? <laughs> is there onion or something on I there? think that's just like an organic freaking potato. Oh, is that what it is? It could be dirt. I'd rather eat a whole bag of Lay's. Me too. Than these ones. But I think, kind of like the pasta, this one tastes more like cardboard, this one tastes more like dirt, that this is more organic and natural or whatever. I think that one is the more expensive. Yep, you're right. The cheap ones were Lay's. Yes. They're yes. 30, 37 cents an ounce. The other one is Luke's White Truffle and Sea Salt Potato Chips. Truffle. Chips. That's what it was. And they're a dollar an ounce. Luke so is three times as much. Luke doesn't know what he's doing. I love Get it right. truffle on top of most anything. I don't like it on this. No, it was trying mm. to be something it's not. It tastes kind of funky. Be this. All right, we got one more to go. One more? What could it be? Last but not least, we have ice cream. It looks like it's vanilla ice cream. It's uh, just a cream color. The one on the left is a little bit more bright white, and the one on the left is more of a cream, like an off-white. I don't know if you're seeing this, Justine, but this one on the right, you can actually see little like vanilla black, beans. Yeah, black little specks. But I have to be honest, I've also at the store seen a few cheap brands add some vanilla beans. Like I've so, seen this in like the briars, like that black container. Can we do this one first? Hmm. I'm still tasting truffle in my mouth. <laughs> it's a very strong taste. So it's hard for me to even sense what's going on now. All I taste is truffle these days. That's good too. How do you tell with ice know. cream? Usually well, like you can tell. And I honestly have no idea. I am perhaps not an ice cream connoisseur. I'm just doing science right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me too. This one does taste smoother. This one tastes a little more icier. It's a little icier. Yeah. I think this is it. I'm gonna go for creamier. It's got more dairy and dairy is more expensive than water. So this got more water, this got more dairy. 
I think that this costs more. Yes! Yeah. Different. Yes! yes. Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Just like we did. I mean, the consistency is just, it's so much more creamy. Woo! So yeah! The, the cheap one is Kroger Vividly Vanilla. It's five cents per ounce. Five cents. And it's the good. other one is Salt and Straw Vanilla. <gasps> And it's 81 cents a pound. Wow. I love salt and straw. Wow. So good. Well, we did really good. All right, that does it for the video. Justine, we did so good. We only missed one. And it was the alcohol. Yeah, and I feel like that's not our fault. We're not sommeliers. I don't know the difference with my spirits. I don't even drink. You know, I'll drink anything at any party. I, I don't know the difference. You heard it here first. <laughs> Okay, this is the first time we ever did this. Please let me know in the comments down below if you guys liked this video because I had so much fun. Again, a big thank you to Justine for doing this with me. This was so much fun. She's the best. You're the best. She's the best. <laughs> Go check her out, subscribe, show her some love. Links down below. And we did videos over on her channel, so go check it out. I put links down below to those too. If you guys liked this new video, give it a thumbs up, click subscribe, it's free, and ring the bell to receive notifications every time I post a new video. All right, thanks again for watching. Bye. Bye. And if you'd like to watch any other videos, you can click up here. Or up here. I'll just help myself just some more salt and straw. Um, yes. They have great flavors mm. there. Have you had the honey lavender? Very good. No. Yep. What am I doing with my life? Don't know.